Hi, I'm Daniel Peck, and welcome to Live at the Bop Stop. Jamie Haddad holds a unique place in both jazz and world music. Working with Yo-Yo Ma, Paul Simon, and Sting, Jamie is one of America's most prominent world music percussionists. We're fortunate in that Jamie graces our stage often and always with a unique mix of musicians and a wide variety of compositions. This quartet performance features the Cincinnati-based duo of pianist Ben Tweet and guitarist Brandon Coleman, both of whom are on tour in support of new albums. Bassist Aiden Plank joins Ben, Brandon, and Jamie from this December 2nd, 2022 performance. It's the Jamie Haddad Quartet, live at the Bop Stop.
Thank you. Um, this next tune is by a, a pianist named Carla Blay, and uh, this tune is entitled Lawns. It's everybody who um, you know, I play with, if I do play this tune, they end up stealing the tune to play, because it's really, a, it's, it's, it's a lovely tune, but it's kind of an unknown tune, a lot of people don't play it, but it's, uh, it's, it's really nice. <laughs>
Thank you. Uh, this next tune's by, um, I guess if you know me at all, then you know that uh, we often play with a good and dear friend of mine. Was my roommate in college, as a matter of fact, and ended up being a partner. We shared a, a farm together for a long time, and we kind of both went our separate ways as families, and so that became a little difficult to maintain. But other than that, we've stayed musically very close, and this is a tune called Brother Jack by Billy Drews, and we still don't know who Brother Jack is. <laughs>
There's more live at the Bop Stop right after this. Have you ever wanted to sit down with musicians and pick their brains? Ask questions like, how did you get your start? What keeps you motivated to create and play? What do you do outside of music that inspires you? Or what advice do you have for aspiring musicians? If you want the answers to those questions from a plethora of musicians and other creatives, listen to the podcast Extra Musical, hosted by me, Stephen Philip Harvey. Every Monday, we sit down with a new musician to ask them these questions in an open-ended conversation, and you'd be surprised where it leads. Extra Musical airs on your preferred podcast provider. You're listening to the Jamie Haddad Quartet, live at the Bop Stop.
Thank you. Uh, this is a tune by, um, um, in Brazil, a very well-known, well, you know, it's hard to say what his position is in popular music in Brazil, but as far as any serious musician in Brazil, Egberto Guishmanti is a very, very um, groundbreaking musician who's, actually he's half Lebanese and half Italian, but all Brazilian schooled in Paris at the Paris Conservatory and came back to Brazil as kind of like a, uh, a child of the extension of uh, the Brazilian tradition of um, music laid out by uh, Hermeto Pascual and contemporary composers like that, but also bringing into play people like Via Lobos and, and that kind of classical element. And this is a tune called Maracatu, and uh, Maracatu is, and uh, Ben kind of mentioned it, is, uh, Maracatu is a rhythm from the Northeast, and it's played during carnival time a lot, and it's been adapted into popular music, and uh, it's, it's one of these funny little beats that has a, a, a deceptive thing to it, where the strong pulse of the beat is exactly right after the, the one you think it isn't. And, um, and it's, uh, you say the name Baracatu, 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 Baracatu. The beat's like ch -ch 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 the one Baracatu, 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 and it's got a bell pattern. So that's what's happening with this tune, but it's kind of a little deconstructed. Here we go. <laughs> Baracatu by Egberto Gishmanti.
Thank you. Uh, uh, this is a tune called Boss Number no. Five by a, a good friend of uh, mine. He plays in the, a group that I have called, um, what's it called? Yeah, oh yeah, Under One Sign. <laughs> and uh, uh, it's called um, Boss Number no. Five. And again, one of these tunes, we don't know what boss number one, two, three, and four sound like, but this is boss number five by Leo Blanco. He's actually from Merida in, uh, in Venezuela, which is an awesome country to visit. And musically, it's off the hook. I thought Brazil kind of had the patent on what was swinging in South America, and my God, one country to the next, just. <laughs>
Thank you all. Drive home safely. Have a great holiday season and stay tuned. There'll be more in the future, I hope. Drive home safe. Live at the Bop Stop is made possible by the Music Settlement, serving Northeast Ohio by offering music instruction, music therapy, and early childhood education since 1912. The Music Settlement's mission is to welcome all to our music and arts community to learn, create, inspire, and heal. This program is recorded at the Robert Conrad Studios at the Bop Stop in Cleveland, Ohio, and the studios of KUNV in Las Vegas, Nevada. Additional production at the Bop Stop is provided by Graham Rosen. Editing for WOBC, WNPA, and the Public Radio Exchange is provided by Dr. Pete Nagley and for our podcast and other radio affiliates by Sean Gilbert at Gillazar Media. The executive producer is Daniel Peck, with additional consulting production by Brian Kennard and Gabe Pollock on behalf of the Music Settlement. 
For extended versions of all of our shows, our Live at the Bop Stop podcast can be found on your favorite podcast app or visit our website at www.themusicsettlement.org and click on the Bop Stop link. To reach out directly, email us at live at the bop stop at gmail.com. I'm Daniel Peck. Join me again next time, live at the Bop Stop. <laughs>